Welcome to Puntun Kids, your favorite channel where we make learning so interesting. And today we are back with a new letter, which also means a new story. And who all are ready for it? Yes, come on, get, set, and go. How do we go? Yes, you're right. We start with the letters. Come on, everyone, let's make the blocks. Brilliant. Let's start saying the letters A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Brilliant job! So, a smiley for all of you. And now, ready with the story? Do you all want to meet someone? There's someone who's coming to meet all of you. Yes? Look who is it? This is Sammy the snake. Who is this? Sammy the snake. Let's say hi, Sammy. Let's say hi, Sammy. And what does he do back? How does Sammy say hi? He hisses. And how does he hiss? Come on, all of you, do it and show me. So, Sammy the snake has come out of his hole because he is very, very hungry. And he also loves to swim. He loves to swim. So, he goes into the water and swims. And he's going to look for some food to eat. So while he was swimming, look who did he meet? He met a starfish. Who is this? Starfish. He said, Sss, and he opened his big mouth and he told the starfish, I'm going to eat you. So the starfish said, please don't eat me. Please don't eat me. I'm so small. I'm just a tiny starfish. Even if you eat me, you're not going to be full. So it does not help you eating me. Please leave me. So Sammy thought to himself, Yes, the starfish is right. My stomach is not going to be full with a small tiny starfish. So he started swimming again. And while he was swimming, look who did he meet? Who is this? It's the seahorse. Yes. And do you all know how does a seahorse swim? It goes up and down, up and down, up and down. And Sammy kept looking at the seahorse going up and down, up and down. And he goes, I am going to eat you up. So the seahorse said, please don't eat me. Please don't eat me. I'm so small. Even if you eat me, you're not going to be full. You'll still be hungry. So why are you eating me? Please leave me. So again, Sammy thought to himself that the seahorse is right. It's so tiny. I'm not going to be full with the seahorse. So he started hissing and swimming again. And he swam and he swam and he didn't find anything to eat. So he went out of the waters. And while he was slithering, see what did he see? A tiny little spider. A tiny little spider. So, what did he say? Sss, I'm going to eat you. And the spider is also so small. So, the spider said, please don't eat me. Please don't eat me. I'm just a tiny small spider. Even if you eat me, you're still going to be so, so, so hungry. Because I'm so small. So Sammy said, yes, that's true. The spider is so tiny. It makes no sense for me to eat the spider. So Sammy started hissing again. 
and started slithering, slithering, slithering. And see what did he see? He saw a snowman. And he said, I'm going to eat you. The snowman said, please don't eat me. Anyways, I am there only during the winters. I'm here only for Christmas. Once the hot sun comes up, see, once the sun comes up, I'm anyways going to melt. So Sammy felt bad for the snowman and he decided to leave the snowman alone. So he started hissing and slithering away. And then who did he meet? He met Sophia and he said, yes, Sophia is big enough for me to eat and my stomach will be full. So he hissed and opened his mouth and said, I'm going to eat you up. And Sophia said, please stop. Don't eat me. If you eat me, you'll have nothing to eat tomorrow. But if you leave me, I will give you yummy snacks to eat every day. So Sammy thought to himself, she's right. I have been looking for food for so long and I didn't find any food. So if I keep Sophia safe, she can give me a lot of food to eat. So he said, okay, Sophia, what are you going to give me to eat? So look what Sophia got for him. Some yummy snacks. She got a yummy, yummy sandwich. And she got some yummy spaghetti. And some yummy healthy soup. S soup. Yes. And Sammy was so happy. So what did he do? He gave Sophia a nice smile. And he went back slithering in his hole and went to sleep. So, did you all like the story about Sammy? Yes? Come on, let's see who all did we meet. Come on. See, we met the seahorse. How does the seahorse swim? Up and down, up and down. And we met a... Who's this? Spider. And we met a... Snowman. And we met a... Starfish. And we met this girl named Sophia. And what did Sophia give Sammy? A sandwich, some spaghetti, and some healthy soup. Yes, and Sammy loved it because all the snacks begin with s soup, s spaghetti, s sandwich. And what does Sammy do all the time? Sss, right? He hisses like this. Come on, all of you hiss like Sammy. Sss, very good. Which letter do you think says? Sss? Come on, think, 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 think. Yes, you're right. It is letter S. Letter S. S says Sss. So, what is the action for the sound? We are going to hiss like Sammy. Yes? Very good. So this is uppercase S and this is lowercase s. See, they almost look the same. Uppercase S, lowercase s. Right? And tell me, who knows what are we going to do next? Come on, tell me, tell me. What are we going to do next? Yes, you're right. Run, run, run. Run to the kitchen and get your steel plates and your clay. So, are we back? Very good. So, let's make letter S. Come on, let's take some clay and roll it, roll it, roll it into a snake. Come on. See, we are going to roll it into a snake to make S. S says S. As in snake and we keep making a snake, right? For all the letters. And just like this curvy 
Sammy, the letter S is also curvy. So how are we going to make it? Let's start, take it a little up and make it like a C. Yes, come on, see, make it like the curly cur and then an ulta curly cur. See, facing the other side, a curly cur facing the other side and cut it off. So this is your letter S. Which letter is this? Letter S. Come on everyone, take your pointer finger and start from up, make a curly cur and then a curly cur on the other side. See? And what are we going to say? This is letter S. S says, what's the action? Yes, come on again. Take your pointer fingers. Yes, make a curly cur and then another curly cur the other way around. This is letter S. And S says, what are we going to do? What's the action? Very good. Good job. And S says, as in, smiley for all the smiling babies there. Very good. And tell me, everyone, what do we do after making the letter? What do we do? Time for your homework. So here I have your worksheet. Mummies, daddies, you all can click a picture. What do we have to do? First, we are going to cross out the image that does not have the s sound. Okay? Come on, let's start. Yeah? When I say alligator, alligator, can we hear the s sound? No. So, we are going to cross it off. Okay? Then, when I say the word star, star, can you hear the s sound? Yes. So, come on, color the star. Now, when I say snowman, snowman, do you hear the s sound? Yes. So, we are going to color the snowman. And when I say seahorse, why is this called seahorse? See, because it looks like a horse, but it lives in the sea. And you know an interesting fact, it's a fish. It's a kind of a fish. So, when I say seahorse, do you hear the s sound? Yes, so we are going to color it. And tell me, how does it swim? Up and down, up and down, up and down. Very good. And what are we going to do here in the lines? We are going to write the letter S. S okay. And we are going to color Sammy. Sammy the snake. See? Sammy is looking just like the letter S. Right? Very good. So, we are going to color Sammy the snake. And after Sammy has eaten such a yummy sandwich and spaghetti and soup, what do you think am I going to do? You know I love food. Yes, I'm going to go and make some spaghetti and some soup and a sandwich for myself and i'm going to sit down and eat it with my big mouth just like sammy and while i do that please do not forget to share like and subscribe bye see you soon agar aapko hamari videos pasand aa rahe hain to inhe like kare comment kare aur subscribe kare